Flashing a fistful of dollars, posing with pop stars, or living it up in at world's most lavish hotels, the rich kids of Venezuela's socialist elite know nothing of the misery their parents have wreaked on their country. Socialist revolution leader Hugo Chavez's oldest daughter Maria Gabriela is rumored to be Venezuela's richest woman, with a personal fortune of more than $4 billion, hidden in bank accounts Europe. The 38-year-old earned her vast fortune while acting as first lady to her socialist president father. Former Lieutenant Colonel Hugo Chavez, after he divorced his second wife. Chavez proclaimed Maria Gabriela my hero when she appealed to Cuban leader Fidel Castro for help following the failed 2002 coup attempt to get rid of his socialist regime. However, Gabriela and other children of Venezuela's socialist elite appear to have forgotten Chavez's galvanizing motto, to be rich is bad. While she hides behind diplomatic immunity from her regime-appointed role of alternative ambassador of Venezuela to the United Nations, her younger sister fled the country in shame, following a public backlash at her flaunting her wealth. Rosine's Chavez jumped on a plane to Paris within hours of posting a picture holding up a fistful of dollar bills on social media in 2016. Now as the 21-year-old is enjoying a carefree student life at the Sorbonne, Venezuela's teachers are practically working for free their wages are so poor due to hyperinflation and university fees are going through the roof. Meanwhile her revolutionary father's successor and his offspring are behaving even worse. President Nicolas Maduro was castigated for his largest after a film went viral of a socialist leader enjoying a huge banquet hosted by celebrity chef Salt Bay in Istanbul in September last year. At home most Venezuelans cannot afford fresh meat. A few months earlier his two stepsons Yasu Cavidia Flores and Walter Cavidia Flores had managed to blow some $45,000 on an extravagant 18-night stay at the Ritz Hotel in Paris, where rooms cost $591 a night. Breakfast is an extra $40. Their hotel bill is the equivalent of the monthly wages of 2,000 Venezuelans. A basic basket of shopping costs 16 times the minimum wage. Six out of ten Venezuelans have a relative who goes without to feed their family, and one in 12 families are forced to scavenge out of the bins for food. These rich Chavista kids have also been spotted in the best restaurants and clothes and jewelry shops in Madrid as part of the lavish lifestyle they have become accustomed to while their stepfather drags their country its knees. Together with brother Yasser, they have been accused of involvement in a multi-million dollar money laundering scheme by U.S. Senator Marco Rubio in September last year. Fortunately for President Maduro, 
His son Nicolasito keeps a much lower profile. HIS only controversy is to have threatened Donald Trump that he would shoot up New York and take over the White House if the US Army invaded during parliamentary speech in 2017. Maduro second in command Diosdado Cabello has attracted the attention of the US Drug Enforcement Agency, while nothing has been proven. His daughter Daniela however has drawn much attention by her stunning good looks and celebrity lifestyle. He our boyfriend is Latin pop singer Omar Acido. However, the Chavista socialist elite have most badly exposed by two nephews of Venezuela's first lady Cilia Flores. Efrain Antonio Campa Flores and Franqui Francisco Flores were jailed in 2017 for 18 years each after they were caught by trying to smuggle $20 million worth of cocaine into the USA via Haiti.